these three words. Immediately you wake up from the bed in the morning and all your wishes shall be granted that day. Don't mistake those three words early in the morning. Some people, when they wake up in the morning, they will just be discussing. They start talking another thing. No. There are things, there are words you need to speak out immediately you wake up from the bed. There are first three words you need to speak. Those words are going to carry you for the day. And you will see how amazing your day is going to be on that day. You will see how God is going to crown all your effort that day with joy, with testimony, with peace and happiness. As you watch, please be patient and God will bless you if you do that. Welcome to my channel. My name is Marvelous. In this channel, we share the word of God. We pray to the glory of God and we show you the way of the Lord. We show you the real truths of the word of God. We speak the mind of God to you and we show you remedies of things to use. When you use those things with faith in your heart, believing on God, calling on the name of the Lord, you will see an outstanding result. You will see testimonies using those natural things. What are these things that we use? Is the things you can see. There are things you can see around in your house. You can see it even in your compound. You can pick it by yourself. Use it with faith and you will see amazing results. As you do so, God bless you. Say these three words. Every day you wake up on the bed, let it be the first thing you will say. Just say these words and you will see how your day is going to be crowned with joy and testimony. I see my face for the first time in this channel. Please remember, you have to subscribe to this channel to the glory of God. Follow us and share our videos. Comment and like to the glory of God. As you do so, God will keep blessing you. What are these words you need to speak? Anytime you wake up in the morning, once you wake up from the bed, just once you wake up from the bed, don't talk to anybody. Don't allow anybody to, to, to distract you. This is the first thing you will do is this. Greet. Good morning, God the Father. Good morning, God the Son. Good morning, God the Holy Spirit. Then you get down from the bed and kneel down. Begin to appreciate God. Glorify the name of the Lord for giving you life. Appreciate God for giving you the grace to see a new day. It's not by might. It's not by power. It's just by the mercy of God. Call God by his name and that spot. Lift the name of God high. Begin to appreciate God. Begin to thank God that you are alive is a privilege. Being alive is a privilege. Waking up from the bed every morning is a privilege. You wake up from the bed, your legs and your hands wake up with you. It's a privilege. Some people will rush to the hospital when they wake up from the bed because of one attack or the other. Then you find yourself that you will you be able to carry your body out of the bed. It's a privilege, my dear. You need to kneel down immediately and raise your hands up and say, Thank you, Jesus, for giving me life. Thank you, Lord, for the privilege to see a new day. Thank you, Lord. Some people died in their sleep. They didn't wake up again. But you, you see it as a privilege to wake up and your eyes are open. You are able to remember your bank account. As you're sleeping, do you remember, do you, remember you, have, you have children? Do you remember you have anything? You do you remember. But maybe you wake up, you start calculating. No, appreciate God first. Greet the Trinity. Then appreciate God. Call God by name and say, Father, thank you for another opportunity to see a new day. Lord Jesus, thank you. I appreciate you. I give you all the glory. I bless your name. I worship you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You have given me an opportunity again to see life. Lord, I say thank you. I appreciate you, Lord. I acknowledge your supremacy. Lord, I say thank you. Lord, I say thank you. For life, for strength, for greatness. Jesus, thank you. For your mercy over my life. You counted me worthy today. Jesus, thank you. Jesus, thank you. I'm privileged to walk in the land of the living again. Jesus, thank you. I appreciate God and you will see God. There is, you see, you see how God will really make your day to be on that day. 
after that one, number two. The number three is this. Call yourself by name. My name is Marvelous. I don't know your name. Say, Marvelous, you are blessed in the morning. You are blessed in the afternoon. You are blessed in the evening. You are blessed in the night. The blessed shall call you blessed. In the name of Jesus, wherever you go today, Marvelous, you will be accepted. No one will reject you today. Marvelous, you will not die. No one will kill you. You will not enter a wrong vehicle. You will not enter a wrong place. You will not enter in a wrong person. You will not enter with wrong people. You will not put your hand in something that will give God, that will make God to be angry with you. Begin to call yourself and speak things that you want to speak to yourself. Speak things to yourself. Say things you want to happen to yourself that day. You know your intentions. You know what you have planned for that day. You know your plans. Begin to speak to yourself that your plan for that day will be successful. Begin to decree what you want for yourself that day. Begin to speak to call yourself by name and begin to pass declarations. Positive declarations. Positive words. Begin to speak it after speaking. Because you know that, see, that thing you're doing at that time, you have already roused parts of heaven. First, you, you, created, you created the Trinity. Secondly, you, you, you appreciate God. You praised God. So prophesying good things to yourself. You are declaring good things to yourself. Let me tell you, there's no how your day will not work well. There is no how you will not end with that day. There is no how your plan for that will not work. There is no how. You have already captured the powers that are in that day. You have captured them. You have taken over. You have taken control of everything that is good for that day. Please learn these things. It will help you. If you can learn this thing, if you can learn it daily, learn it weekly, learn it monthly, learn to do these things yearly. Let it be part of you. Learn to do it every day. Don't miss it. Don't make mistake. In this season, God is going to shower your life with mercy. God will show you mercy. God will remember you. God will favor you. Nothing will be so hard for you to get. Are you looking for money to travel? Go make it to happen. Go will shower you with favor. Your doors will be open. That money you are expecting, God will bring it to your doorstep. Are you looking forward to get connection contracts? You're going to see it. Unexpected blessing will come to you. What you did not work for will come to you. That blessing you never planned for will locate you in the name of Jesus. Please, in everything, learn to make friends with Christ. In everything, you need to make friends with Jesus. Give your life to Christ and you will see God showing himself mighty in everything that concerns your life. Read the word of God. Pray every day. Commit your ways always into God's care. Especially this season, commit your ways. Don't just go on your own. Let God lead you so that you will not get trapped, so that no evil will befall you. As you do that, God bless you. Do you find value in this video? Do you love what you see? Please do well to hit the like button. Share this video to the glory of God, to your friends and your family members. It will, be, it will, it will help some people. There are people who need to know this. Share this video. As you're sharing this video, you are blessing your life. What did you learn in this video? Please. I appreciate God in the comment section to the glory of God. If you have not following us to this channel, please do to follow us. Yes, follow us, subscribe, and remember to always press the notification bell. So anytime I upload a new video, you can get notified. And once you get notified, you will watch and see what is God saying at that time. As you do so, God bless you and God keep keeping you. Thank you for watching and see my next video. God bless you.